What's going on guys? In this video I'll be going over a Red Dead Redemption 2 online XP glitch. But before I get into the video, if you haven't checked out my channel before, I talk about Red Dead Redemption 2 online content. So if you're interested in that kind of stuff, definitely consider subscribing. But other than that, getting into it, so you're going to want to head over to the town of Rhodes, which is right here on the map, as you can see pretty clearly. And the building you're going to want to head over to is like the workshop next to the general store. It's a pretty easy building to find in the middle of Rhodes. It's this one right in front of me with the coffins in front of it. So with this glitch, basically what you are going to do is head over there. You want to take out your lantern and take out a pistol, and you're going to want to do the wall glitch to glitch inside of it. And to do this, you want to basically just look straight at the ground with the pistol or revolver, and then you're going to walk into the door, and then you just kind of want to inch yourself in. It's kind of a little glitchy, obviously, because it's a glitch. So it, it's relatively easy to go in, and if you don't get it the first time like I did, you just keep trying, and it will work eventually. And then once you get in here, all you're really going to want to do is just start rifling down some cops and, you know, just shoot a couple people, and then you're just going to get a bunch of law on you. So one thing with this glitch as well, you can only look through, like, the front side and back of it. You can't look through, like, that left part over there because technically that is another building, so it doesn't work. And also one thing with this glitch as well, there's like a couple of those coffins right in front of you and the door and like a couple of those like side random like barrels and stuff on the side. So you still can't shoot through those technically, but you can just simply shoot through the walls that aren't there because of this glitch. And the spot's really great because it's in roads, it's in the middle of town, so it's really easy to get the law on you and it's really easy to get a lot of them. Um, attracted and near you so it's really easy for those reasons and it's also really easy because it's one of the few locations that actually works with this glitch a lot of the other locations um, it doesn't actually work because you can get inside of it but you can't actually do things like shoot out of it so uh, this is one of the few locations that actually works it's an easy way to get a ton of xp and another easy way to get a ton of xp is by resetting your award which i can't do yet because i actually just made a new character so all my awards are really low but th some things basic things you're going to want to do is uh one aim for headshots which is pretty easy to do uh two if people are sitting on their horse still uh, you're going to want to shoot them and three you actually do hip fire headshots like i just did right there to get some extra xp as well and obviously the only downside of this is that uh, you will eventually start to uh, lose some honor, especially if you do this a lot, which I personally don't care about, but um, I'm sure in the future there might be some people who uh, start to care about losing that honor. And besides that, uh, one other thing that you can do for more XP is use different ammo types, which I really don't um, want to do right now, because one, I'm too low of a level, and two, because it does cost a lot of money unless you could find it somewhere on the map, which you can somewhat easily, but I don't think that's necessarily um, needed for only like five to ten more XP, especially because some of that ammo can be very expensive if you don't have a lot of money. But other than that, guys, that really is it for this glitch. And one other big thing you could do as well is just you know focus on those awards, see which awards you can level up and which ones you uh, you know need to do and which ones you can reset, things of that nature. And um, also, guys, if you're enjoying the video and if it helped at all, definitely leave a like and comment below. And uh, also one last thing, guys, if you're new to the channel, I talk about Red Dead Redemption 2 online content, tips, tricks, glitches, things like that. So if you're interested in that type of stuff, definitely head on my channel, consider subscribing. And if you like what you're seeing in this video, also, like I said before, definitely consider leaving a like. It really helps the channel out a lot. But other than that, guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed.